Hi everybody, I'm Mike, this is Budget Guns and Gear Reviews, and today we're going to go over the gear that I took to the Pathfinder Basic class. Stick around, maybe we'll learn something together. When you go to the Pathfinder School, there's a very specific list of equipment that you have to take with you, and you're responsible for carrying it with you everywhere you go. It basically covers the 10 C's of survivability. So let's go ahead and take a look at uh, what I chose to bring with me to meet these needs. The first thing you're supposed to bring with you are your cutting tools. Your knife should be 90 degree spine carbon steel non-coated blade and I chose to bring my Veristaleka Jakari Puko. You're also responsible for bringing a folding saw and I chose to bring my Corona razor tooth pictured here. The next set of items you have to bring are your combustion devices. You're supposed to bring two Bic lighters, which I did, I only have one still in my pack though. Your one half inch by six inch ferro rod, which I took this Bayite ferro rod I got from Amazon, a flint and steel kit, and a 5X magnifying glass. The next set you're supposed to bring is your cover element, which consists of four 55 gallon drum liners that are six mil thick, and boy oh boy do you learn to hate them. Uh, watch my video here to see why. A grabber 5x7 space blanket. You can use any reusable space blanket, but I chose the grabber for this. And either one queen or two twin wool blankets. I chose these Ectos wool, wool blankets. They are twin size, and I'll give a link to everything below. Next, you need to bring your cordage, which is a 100 foot of number 36 bank line and at least 25 feet of paracord. For your metal container, you're supposed to bring a 32 ounce net bottle and nesting cup, and I chose to take my Pathfinder bottle and cup set. Next comes your compass and navigation piece, and I chose to take a Sunto MC2 and the Ranger beads sold by uh, Self Reliance Outfitters. Next up is your cloth and repair piece, and I took a chamois, some scrap cotton cloth for making char cloth, and a number 14 sail needle. Next comes the candling device, which I took my Cobiz 6000 lumen waterproof headlamp, which we'll be getting a video of its own soon. This thing is awesome. It's very bright. The last two items are your cargo tape and combination tool. I took Gorilla Tape, which is what Dave recommends, although I think T-Rex tape would probably work as well. That stuff seems to be pretty good. And I took my Gerber suspension. Now, as for things that aren't part of the 10 C's yet are still required to take, and you definitely want to take for taking notes, an all-weather notebook and some write-in-the-rain pens. Uh, you also want to take whatever food you're going to need and hygiene items, medications, etc. Uh, I recommend that you take food that you do not have to cook, that you can eat on the go because you are busy, 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 and you they don't give you breaks to stop and make a meal. I mean, you are on the go constantly, so take something with you that you don't have to heat to eat. In order to carry all this stuff, I put it on a uh, sort of a, a web gear system using an H harness. I used a Voodoo Tactical padded sniper's belt, which they no longer make, which is sad because it's a good piece of kit, uh, with a bunch of Molly pouches attached to it, and a... Uh, military sleep system carrier lashed to the back to carry the uh, wool blankets and whatnot. It worked, it distributed the weight really well, uh, but the molly pouches tended to get in the way, so I'm gonna have to figure out something a little more compact. So I'm Mike, this is Budget Guns and Gear Reviews, and this is the gear I took with me to the Pathfinder Basic class. There's gonna be an upcoming video on how my choice of gear for my personal loadout whenever I go out in the woods is going to change based on my experience in the class. Um, I'm going to make some additions and subtractions to what I normally carry. Uh, so uh, stay tuned for that one. If you like what you saw, please like, share, subscribe. Consider becoming a patron on my Patreon account. Every little bit that, uh, of support that you can give me helps. And uh, coming soon, I'm going to be uh, doing some drawings for my patrons to uh, give them away some stuff as sort of a thank you for showing uh, your support for me. So stick around and uh, check that out. Um, you know, and as always, come on back. Maybe we'll learn something together.
what you want, what you want, what you want.